Gentlemen, stop trying to fight baldness. It's okay. Me as a member of the bald head delegation can tell you that I, you will not have any issues finding a woman just because of your hair or lack thereof. But you will deter women when you walk out of here with stuff glued onto your scalp and face. And there are just so many different reasons why it's ineffective. Understood that women live by the concept of every day of the year is Halloween. At least half of them. They have different hair, different wigs, different weave, different makeup. So it's somewhat of a dress up for them. And it's not a big deal. You meet a woman, she's got a different hairstyle. You know that's not her hairstyle. You know that's a wig or whatever. You can live with that. The woman, on the other hand, is not going to accept that she meets you with a head of hair. And next thing she finds out is glued into your scalp. You might lose her after the first week. Second reason. There's so many risks to your skin. I don't know what concoction they were using on this man's head to glue that hair onto his scalp and face, but I can only imagine the rash, the infection, the kind of stuff you're going to deal with as a man when you put that stuff into your head. It's genetic. I believe it's if your mother's daddy was bald or losing hair, odds are you are going to end up at one point or another going bald or losing hair. So look at your grandfather if he's alive on your mother's side and you already know that it's inevitable. Most importantly, love yourself as you are. You know, as men, we can't really do much but go to the gym, get a fresh cut and put on a suit and look good. We don't have all the additional accessories that women engage in. And when you try to go down that road, it eventually makes you look stupid. Because women are going to find out and a woman that thinks you got a head full of hair and next thing you know, she see glue and stuff falling off your face. The date's going to be over real quick. Next reason is that for the most part, women understand that half of these men out here going to go bald. And once you got the Stephen A. Smith hairline, you might as well shave it all and join the Michael Jordan Club. It's less trips to the barber. You can shave with a razor and move on. It's real quick. And it actually, some women like the style. So please, refrain from doing this. It'd be a service to yourself and to everybody else. And the last reason for me is, this is just another thing that women can come and say, men do it too. And even though these guys, like the one in the beginning of the video, are in great minority, it's starting to become a little bit more common. And they have a point. Family, please check out my new sponsor, cloudstyle.com. They have suits, jackets, blazers, pants, accessories. I mean, the finest of suits at affordable prices. Three-piece, two-piece, vests, uh, tuxedos, any kind of suit you can think of. And these suits are vintage. These suits are classic, flawless. Also, more importantly than that, in addition to the great price of the quality of the suits, you put in my code, 20FREDDY. That's 20-F-R-E-D-D-Y. If you buy a suit, when you check out and you receive an additional 20% off the suit. Suits are seriously fire. Check them out. www.cloudstyle.com.